What's going on guys? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome to the channel. Today we're going to talk about Xbox One, Xbox One exclusives, how badly Xbox One needs more exclusives, and a huge Xbox One exclusive that has now been cancelled. That's right, if you guys haven't heard the news, Scalebound for Xbox One has been cancelled indefinitely and this is earth shattering news for people who play only on the xbox one i know a lot of people including myself was looking forward to seeing how this game turned out platinum games has made some really stellar games in the past uh not so much recently with the teenage mutant ninja turtles game but bayonetta 2 was my game of the year for 2014 and i was looking forward to seeing what they were going to bring to the xbox one unfortunately this game is not going to happen now i'll drop a link in the description xbox one exclusive scale bound cancelled microsoft confirms Scalebound, the much-anticipated dragon action game from Platinum Games, has been cancelled by Microsoft Studios, the publisher announced today. Quote, After careful deliberation, Microsoft Studios has come to the decision to end production for Scalebound. We're working hard to deliver an amazing lineup of games for our fans this year, including Halo Wars 2, State of Decay 2, Sea of Thieves, and other great experiences, end quote, said a Microsoft spokesperson to Polygon. The announcement confirms a report from Kotaku, which cited multiple sources in saying that Scalebound was, quote, in trouble and may be cancelled, end quote. Eurogamer also reported today, based on multiple sources, that Microsoft and Platinum have parted ways and that Platinum has stopped working on the project before the end of 2016. Quote, with continuing issues surrounding the game's engine and overdue deadlines, the decision was made that the project could no longer continue, end quote, said Eurogamer. Scalebound was announced back at Microsoft's E3 2014 press briefing as an Xbox One exclusive. Platinum's Hideki Kamiya took the stage to promise, quote, action at a whole new scale, end quote, showing a trailer in which players teamed up with a massive dragon to battle giant monsters. Microsoft bought Scalebound to Gamescom 2015 to show off four-player co-op action. At the time, the company said it was aiming for a holiday 2016 window. However, just over a year ago, Microsoft delayed the game to 2017. The company most recently mentioned Scalebound in July of 2016 as one of the titles that would support the Xbox Play Anywhere initiative, which allows for compatibility and in some cases a cross-buy feature between a game's Xbox One and Windows PC versions. Scalebound did appear at Gamescom in August, but it was not playable there. Kotaku noted that prior to Microsoft's cancellation announcement, the company had removed Scalebound's page from the official Xbox website. The past year has been rough for Platinum Games. The Japanese studio released three poorly received titles in 2016. Star Fox Zero and the bundled title Star Fox Guard, both of which were co-developed with Nintendo, and the abysmal Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutants in Manhattan, which was pulled from digital storefronts last week. With the cancellation of Scalebound, Platinum's only 2017 project is the action role-playing game Nier Automata, which is scheduled to be released on March 7th in North America. The studio is also working on two undated titles, Grand Blue Fantasy Project Relink and Lost Order. This is bad news, and it's bad news in more ways than one. I, I feel bad for everybody who's looking forward to this game. It did look like it could be great uh, when they showed that four-player co-op. It just didn't grab me. It didn't look like it was super duper exciting. I was hoping that Platinum would turn it around. And then me, like an idiot, I went and bought the Turtles game, uh, Mutants in Manhattan for PS4. And that was a huge flop that made me look at Platinum a little bit differently. Nier looks like it'll be okay. But if they had this game cooking for this long and then decided to just totally cancel it, I don't know how bright the future is going to be for Platinum. The, the problem with Platinum games is this. They have too many projects at one time. You can't focus on, you know, five projects at the same time and put that same amount of quality in each one. You know, Platinum needs to work on one, maybe two games at a time, and that needs to be it. This is what happens when you develop four, five, six games at a time. You're not able to put that same degree of pedigree into your games. You're splitting talent, you're splitting minds, and you're splitting hairs when it comes to the development process. And ultimately, in the end, it's going to it's gonna bode poorly for Platinum. I feel really bad for people who are looking forward to this game. It looked like it could have been great. But this is just what happens when you try to put too much on your plate at one time. It's just too much to digest from a development point of view. And it looks like the way that this ended, Platinum and Microsoft Studios might not be working together anymore. When contracts and deals are ended in, in, in very scathing and poor manners like this, it leaves a bad taste in the mouth of both parties. And more than likely, this is going to have a lasting effect or a chilling effect when it comes to Microsoft working with Platinum in the future. I hope Platinum gets their stuff together soon because acts like this make them look bad in the gaming community. 
amongst other developers and publishers. You guys let me know what you think in the comments below. Are you disappointed or saddened that Scalebound is not coming out anymore? It's been completely canceled. Were you looking forward to this game or were you going to pass it by? Let me know what you think in the comments below. If you enjoyed the video, please give a thumbs up, show support for the channel, join the Facebook group, follow me on Twitter, and you can support the channel at BeastlyGamer.com. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time.